Rob, defeat here this afternoon. What was your assessment? I think goals change games. and um, It was a tight game. I thought we, at times in the first half, played some good football. Um, we disappointed the manner of both the goals. Um, and maybe it was just a game too too far for us at the moment, um, particularly after Tuesday night. You know, we invested a lot emotionally and physically in that. Um, we tried to freshen it up, but one, you know, but um, it just wasn't wasn't to be today. I think, um, as I say, it was probably just a ninety minutes too much for us just at the moment. Yeah, I mean, like you say, it was a, it was a big night for them Tuesday night, and it, yeah, it, it is going to affect people, isn't it? Of course it is. You know, I, I just said there to, to people, you know, they're, they're they're human beings, and and we've been under this in this, if you like, this almost pressured situation mm. for for a long time. So there's a natural element, and I thought I actually thought if we could get through the first 45 minutes and be even, I really fancied us to kick on in the second half. But then, obviously, the goal. Um, you know, the goal changed, it gives really gives them something to cling on to and, and credit to them, they're well organised, they made it difficult for us and, and you know, the, the, they haven't conceded a lot of goals since Phil went in, um, so they're always going to be difficult to break down and we just didn't have enough today. The, the goal that we conceded, that second one, so un uncharacteristic for uh, for Joel, isn't it? He's had a, right. an excellent season. He's been unbelievable, 45 games and, and by the way, there were a couple of weak challenges before that, so it wasn't just down to Joel and he knows, he's disappointed, but... If I think back now to, to all the games, you know, 45 games he's played and his level of consistency and, and what he's given us and offered us, um, to say he's only been really, you know, personally responsible for one goal, I think that's remarkable for, for, for him. And like I say, he's, um, you have to be mentally tough to play that position. I always think number nine and, and the goalkeeper, they're the two mentally most demanding positions because you're in the spotlight. You make a mistake, there's nothing, there's a, good, there's a goal, there's a goal behind you or you, you put the ball in the crowd when you should score. <laughs> um, so there's no hiding place. But he'll be, you know, it's, he'll be suffering now, but he'll be better for it. He'll, he'll you know, toughen him up a, a little bit more and, and he'll move on because he's been great for us. On a positive this afternoon, Scott Cooley with his 15th of the season. Yeah, I mean, how well has he done? Considering where we are on the table, that is a yeah, heck of a record, done, isn't it? He's done really, really well. Um, but all sort of people around him to create the chances. Luke James, you know, I bet you, you know, if you look at his goals, a lot of them will be him assisting. So, you know, Scott's done great to finish it because it's a, like I say, it's a demanding, mentally demanding position, that one. But, um, but he's also had a lot of support and help. So. Talking of support, a few of them turned up outside yeah, the ground great. today and no, singing your name. Well, not sure. That, no, the most important thing is that, 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 that I think they'll be able to come into Holker Street next August and I think they'll make a massive difference uh, to the club. Um, it's a really exciting time now for the club. Uh, it's not done yet, we've still got another 90 minutes to go, but I just think, you know, 5,000 in here and, you know, next August it'll be, it'll be a different place. And on the flip side, just a quick word on on Southend and, and obviously disappointment yeah, for Phil Brown. Are. I am. They had a good guy, uh, you know, a, a good go at us today. Um, he's really to give him, put him in, a, in with a chance of staying up. I think he's done a really good job, uh, and you could see today he's got them well organised. He's got them fighting for him, but um, and I am disappointed for him and obviously the club. But you know, my 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 job and my concerns Barrow. So that's 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 what I look at.